Hello, Musto006, we're back for part two of I Want to Be the Permanence. Last time, managed to clear up the collect the item games era in the top left. Uh, managed to beat a cherry boss as well, a very tedious cherry boss. But uh, yeah, went okay ish. First two screens were done like in about two minutes, and then the rest of the rest of, <laughs> rest of the era gave me some problems, particularly that screen with the cherries that you have to uh, manoeuvre to destroy them to take out the blocks in your way. Oh, that screen's terrible. <laughs> I don't like that screen at all. But anyway, yeah, first area done, and we're going to be moving on, as I said, in a knight's pattern around a chessboard to the middle right, which the area is apparently called Thutamau. I've probably butchered the pronunciation of that, but oh well. Uh, like I said, this area doesn't have a boss, so in theory it might take less time to get through, but probably not, because, uh, yeah, this one is trigger-happy to a ridiculous extent, and uh, while I'd like to think I can remember most of what goes on here, the chances are that I can't remember everything, and that things are going to keep screwing me over. Thank you. But this is right, but yeah, a bit confused there as to why, why I kept failing that, or, or that, that, that kept triggering way ahead of where I wanted it to. Um, anyway, next time I die I'll probably talk about things a bit more. Take that one out. I think there's a spike that's chasing me up here, isn't there? Yep, that comes up. Ah, oh, I messed that up. Okay, anyway, right, so let's, let's start again. Trigger, whoops. Trigger here, land there. Get past four spikes there, not three, because one spike rises up, and be careful to jump quickly uh, when you land on the ground. Obviously, that spike uh, moves to the left hand side and tries to get us. So, yeah, that's the spike down here triggers, so watch out for that. The spike here triggers, so watch out for that. And then be quick when you get up here, because the spike rises up there, and be quick when you get up there. I'd recommend landing on the left hand edge of those blocks. Obviously, so because the spike, when it rises up, is going to appear in the middle more than that is on either side uh, to start off with, so uh, yeah. Where I would recommend being. Fake that spike out. Through there, up through there quickly. Fake that out. Nice. Over here. Oops, didn't go far enough to the right hand side. Fake that out. Nice. Fake these out. And if memory serves, there's one last screw you. Yes. Good. <laughs> okay. Yeah, like I said, I played this very recently. So I'd like to think that I give a good idea where most of these triggers are. So, yeah, we're very trigger happy in this area. That was awful. That was equally awful. So, yeah, trigger there. And you want to write, uh, wow, when you want to go in this little. Um, obviously, you could do that as well if you, if you don't trigger it out on the drop down. I, I typically just would like to do that, but it's not the end of the world if you don't. Now, I'm going to go to the right hand side there. I figure the momentum actually on doing that would, pro would probably be, be helpful. Yeah. I'm probably just going to do the F jump here. You can fake that, fake out that spike out, and then land over here. But frankly, it's quite difficult to do. And even though I don't particularly like doing the F jump, I'd probably rather do that, frankly, than trigger out that spike. <laughs> if you pull off the successful F jump, F jump then you'll you'll avoid it anyway. Uh, yeah, get in the middle here. Wait, wait for the, for the spikes to come down. And we have a very annoying trigger. I don't like that one at all. <laughs> Uh, yeah, you need to you need to go quite a way over to the left hand uh, to the left hand side there in order to in order to uh, get that spike to actually um, yeah to trigger and move and move to the left and then oh what and then what Flip. okay that's the most annoying spike of the, of the screen so far um, oh my god what the hell I'm jumping like way too early here or all, all the time now what the hell yes yeah, okay. Yeah, it, whoa, okay, we should get back there. Yeah, this is, yeah, this one is, because look, like that, for example, didn't trigger it, that didn't trigger it. You have to, you have to, and that didn't even trigger it. You have to go really quite away to the, um, uh, to the left there, and then it seems like land almost back on the ledge. Like that, that, uh, that was, I did not expect to be able to pull that off. That was, that was pretty good. And well, let's not mess up at the very end, please. I did. I knew it was coming. I, uh, yeah, I, I, obviously you saw me jump like way too, uh, well, or way earlier than I, than I would have done had I not thought that, that trap was there. All well, those spikes were gonna, were gonna come at me there. I'd, I'd have jumped way later. Uh, but, oh man, I didn't even know, I didn't know you could do that while I just did there. That was, uh, in, impressive in, in some, in some regards. Um, but, uh, yeah, I, 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 I just jumped obviously clearly a little bit too, too early still in fact, and, and hit the spike uh, yeah, that, that moved to the side, that was on the side of the wall there. 
I did it again. Okay, I need to drop down. I think a lot lower actually, and then do a more, and then do a full jump over, over to, over to where I want to get to. I'm not doing it. I'm not doing this. Uh, like it's like that, but I still hit the damn thing. Okay, I was actually expecting the spike um, that was going to rise up from the platform to be the one that I was going to that, that, that I was going to hit more often than not, but apparently not. But anyway, we're done. Cool. I guess I, I want to make a point here of make of, of, of yes, yeah, it's very obvious and clear that you've hit the save here. I did make a point on the on the previous video that uh, they're actually uh, yeah, some of the screen the saves are coloured to the point where it actually looks where it's actually. Whoops, um, yeah, sometimes not immediately obvious that you've actually hit the save, so, um, yeah. Ding it. Okay, how on earth do I trigger that out and survive, then? Like that, then. Fine. Oh, please. No, 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 no. Thank... Oh, what is going on? Thank you, I didn't die. <laughs> Still, that was, uh, that was clumsy. Yeah, this is the glitch of the colour save where I have to take I have to actually make a specific point of looking quite closely to make sure I've actually saved. Anyway, moving on. Uh, yep, okay, that's, that triggers there. Right. This triggers once you get past a certain point. That one, yeah, that one triggers down and this one triggers up. So it's like triggering down here, so we do a gate jump. Well, we actually die on it anyway. So yeah, this one, this one rises up. How good would it be to demonstrate? Uh, yeah, this one. Yeah, this one goes to the right-hand side. And this one. Yeah, if you go past the, to certain points to the left, you trigger that one out. Yeah, that one triggers the gate. So pull, pull it off as a, as a regular gate jump. And now we get a bit of a breather. No triggers until we get down to the wall. Oh, if only it were that easy, though. Unfortunately, we have a whole. We have triggered trigger happy again on the way back to the wall. And most of them are probably okay. This one, on the other hand, not really okay. But I pulled it off, and I pulled it off quite amazingly quickly. The first time I got down to that lane in the, 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 yeah, the middle, the bottom there, that was, wow, incredible. I say, yeah, I've, I've played this very recently, so I know where I'm like, oh, wow, well, at the moment, I'm almost, almost trying to where all of them are, which is fantastic. I mean, I've died to them a lot, you know, many times when I was playing this the first time around, but quite a lot of them stick in your memory, to be honest. Um, but I was not expecting to uh, get past these uh, so quickly uh, 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 at the moment, so, uh, yeah. Okay, cool. And then the, these spikes trigger up, so I want to go down and then to the right. Yep. And this one triggers over to the left, so I want to go over there. Uh, spikes rise up here, no real surprise. That one triggers to the right. And then here, I just want to attempt to at least do, do the jump. But yeah, the spikes are hanging from the left-hand side then, and the right-hand side indeed go away. And we can just move up to there, up to the top left and get the save. Yeah, pretty easy save, that one, actually. Must admit. Uh, but uh, yeah, we're still not done with the um, warps flying around all over the place. So I forgot about that one. Okay. I think that might be the first one that I sort of uh, com leg leg legitimately completely forgot about. These all trigger. So I just uh, rush through and just make some deep jumps off. I pulled that off uh, straight away as well. Nice. Okay. Um, I'm looking at the timer and we have not even been going, or just been going over eight, just over eight minutes. And we are at pretty much the final bit. However, this final bit is I'm gonna yeah to use, to use the phrase I I, 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 I said in, in uh, the very beginning in the introduction of part one this screen is and and the transition to the next screen or what you do on the next screen is disgusting I hate this I absolutely hate this so yeah we've breezed through so far but um, yeah the first half of this not so bad I don't really have too many complaints admittedly actually the first half of this screen is probably going to be the one that, that's, uh, that's, that I'm not going to easily remember where the where the um, all the things are going to rise up from because with some of them and certainly some of the traps we've seen on the other screens, I don't want to say they seem obvious, but do those rise up? Okay, just that one. That was awful. But I could go away with it. Oh, really? That was pathetic. Um, but yeah, I, I've, I've had so I've had sort of so much practice on the second half of this. I say practice, not that it's going to help. Not that it's going to help me any. Um, but yeah, I'm just so used to replaying the bloody uh, second half of the screen over and over and over again that the first half is sort of just uh, yeah. I don't really remember it all that well. <laughs> um, oh my god, no! I do not want to be dying to that. I'm going to seriously. We're going to we're going to be absolutely sick to death of this screen um, come the end of it. I do not want to. Do not want to be uh, yeah, dying so stupidly on you know, the bottom half of it. That's awful. Oh, 
Okay, good. Probably gonna get screwed over here, to be honest. Nope, okay, good. I don't think there's any more, yes, until we get there. Okay, fine, we're good. Right. So at least we got to the halfway point. There are, however, so okay, let's see if we can save there so we can just do that. Because, uh, yeah, like I said, we're probably going to be hanging around on this screen for an, um, an eternity. That jump there is absolutely god awful. Um, thankfully, the two spikes are not both the highest they could be. I'm not technically sure whether it would be possible to pull that off if they were, but um, yeah, that jump I absolutely hate. Um, and, um, yeah, I don't want to say be stuck on it for ages, because I think I'd back myself to do it, like, I don't know, every one in ten goes or something, but that's a pretty feeble success rate for that manoeuvre, frankly. Uh, and given what comes after it, yeah, it's just going to, this, this, this stream is going to be, he's going to be uh, awful. <laughs> the rest of it's gone by amazingly well. Um, I mean, typically... This, I must admit, is probably not my kind of one of those kind of areas that I would tend to like. The heavy, the heavy on the the tricks, the traps, uh, and stuff like that. Particularly when it's just like spikes triggering out and stuff like that. Because there are a lot of them. I mean, not this screen per se, but just in general. Like even the first, like, even the first screen. There's just you know that took again so long to do first time round because there's just, again there were just so many. There's at least I'd say ten spikes there to trigger. Um, they're not all really easy to avoid as well, so you're going to get, you know, there's ten things that are going to catch you out first time around, first time you get to them, no question. And, um, yeah, it, it, <laughs> they're not, yeah, they're not easy to, they're not all easy to avoid, so, um, yeah, it's going to be, uh, one of those areas that typically you'd be, you'd be on for absolutely ages, and indeed I was when I first, um, um, first played this area. But, uh, yeah, this, this one, this screen... Uh, it's going to take. It's going mean, to take longer than. The, it might even. Yeah. Well, yeah. It's going to take longer than the entire rest of the rest of the the area. I uh, almost absolutely guarantee that fact. Um, and maybe even this jump. Uh, I won't get past that within the uh, time it's taken to uh, to get to to get to, get to the screen. Because, well, I mean, it's, it's one of those low ceiling ones. Um, obviously, but. It's, it's so bad. It's awful. I hate that jump. And unfortunately, the bits that, are, that come after it are not easy at all. They are, they are really difficult as well, cause me a lot of trouble, and I end up just getting bogged down in this area so much because that jump is just absolutely awful. Right, you get to the top, and that looked awful, and it was. But unfortunately, in fact, I possibly should have stopped there and just let that game over play out. Um, I mean, well, I guess we'll see probably on the successful run when I do it. But unfortunately, that bit at the top is probably really not so bad on its own. But you can't just... In fact, let's just stop there. No, it's, it's stopped. But you can see, you can probably see just to the right of the, the white icon. Uh, that we're going to need to collect just to get the warp. There's a couple of spikes that are just sort of sticking out now. And you can see they're not there now. Um, those slowly protrude down, and if you're not quick enough at the top, will block your path. So you have to do that top bit in a mad dash rush. Um, and I hate it because um, yeah, it's again none of these manoeuvres are are on their on their own. I say that tricky to avoid, but. I feel like I have to really, really rush that section. I mean really rush that section. There is feels like there's such or so little time um, to make it over to the left hand side where you need to in order to in order to jump between those two spikes um, that are eventually gonna protrude down uh, potentially gonna protrude out. Um, and so you can jump through. Because man, I I I oh I, I back myself. I, seriously, I back myself most, most, you know, 90 probably percent of the time. Maybe that's a bit generous. Maybe 75 percent of the time to clear the manoeuvres or, or just to do the do the bit at the top if I had no no time pressure. But the fact that I'm under time pressure for that um, for this bit at the top is just awful. It's absolutely awful, and I, I suck so much at it. And regrettably, even when you even when you clear, unless I'm missing something on the next screen, even when you clear all of this and you clear that bit at the top, you're not done. You have got to do 
a, a, another a, 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 a fairly obnoxious manoeuvre after all this, coming off the back of all this. If there were a save point before it, or something, then I'd, ha I'd have no qualms about it. But you have to do another manoeuvre on the next screen. Well, I lost my double jump there, I don't know why. Um, yeah, but you, you have to pull off having to... What the hell? Excuse me? I'm clearly landing on... I'm clearly, like, landing on the floor after there and not trying to, I'm not trying to, not trying to do that immediately afterwards. There's, there's, just, there's no way. That's about three times in a row there that I've lost my double jump. So, yeah, the bit of, yeah the bit, unfortunately, the bit at the top is not the end of it. Not, yeah, not the end of it. So, uh, when I finally pull that off, I mean, here's hoping that I can pull off the thing afterwards first go, because, I mean, otherwise... Yeah, it's horrible. Okay, and that spike triggers up as well. So, uh, yeah, I didn't want to hang around there because I just didn't want to muck around with the spikes coming down, so I wanted to get out of the way. I wanted to get out of the way. Yeah, basically, I, guess that I, I, I just want to, I basically just want to go for this and just, and just go at it, but is there some trick to this? Is there honestly some trick if I go somewhere on the screen that gets rid of one spike up there in the, in the top in the top uh, in the top right or something because basically i mean i, I think i figure I, I figure that i actually tried this um because i got so i got fed up I, I failed on this twice if, uh, when i first when i first did it and i was like okay there's got to be something here but i couldn't find anything there's again no save at this point in time i can't find an invisible one anywhere or anything like that i can't find anything as i say that triggers any of the spikes here to make this easier yeah having got through that nightmare of what of, of, of the of the maneuvers on that last screen you've got to pull off this diamond um yeah without without a save and don't and yeah the fact that i pulled that off does not in any way detract from the annoyance incredible annoyance that that section is the yeah i pulled that off for the first go that is incredible i'm not going to get I, yeah I'm so, I'm so happy i'm not going to see get immensely bogged down in that section i'm not going to get immensely frustrated for all my moaning there i think that took about nine minutes or so which is which is longer than it took to get to that screen obviously a bit of it was mucking around at the bottom so maybe it was only six minutes or so but man the first time i did that 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 jump over the two spikes in the middle in the, in the middle section of the last save is awful i hate the bit at the top under pressure again i reiterate none of those maneuvers are that are all that bad at all if you're not under immense time pressure which i really feel like you are you really feel like you have to um dash dash to the left there to get ahead of those the spikes that come down and i don't know if i'm missing something on that final screen but if i go somewhere actually it triggers out one of those spikes of, of the uh, at the top right there so you don't have to pull off a diamond fine but it's again i couldn't find it unless it again okay, unless i just did something stupid if it's something stupid I hold my hands up and accept it, but I couldn't. I couldn't find it. I couldn't find any visible save, and the fact that you have to pull off that manoeuvre, that diamond, which again, on its own, not the worst thing in the world at all. If there was a save point on that screen, I wouldn't even, you know, wouldn't even be saying, wouldn't even making anything of it. <laughs> It'd be a bit tedious just to go all the way around the screen just to have to pull off that diamond at the end. But if there was a save there or something, fine. It is. It is revolting. <laughs> Downright revolting that, 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 that you have to pull that maneuver off after having to pull off the uh, the bit the the, the the yeah the second half of the previous screen. I hate that. And yeah, it's not the only um, not the only uh, section of this game or save in this game that I think is uh, the, you know, that it just pulls that kind of crap and that just was completely unnecessary and uh, just not needed whatsoever. But anyway, it's done. I'm just over the now. I'm just coming up to the 20 minute mark now. I'm not going to start a new area uh, now, uh, and you know, start the next area, which will be the bottom left, continuing on the um, night around the chessboard pattern. Um, but uh, yeah, so it's going to be a fairly short one, or, or barely 20 minutes. But um, yeah, I feel like it would be quite long if I actually got into the next stage. So uh, yeah, we'll leave the uh, Fu Tao Mao area again. Apologies for butchering the pronunciation. If indeed I have, um, we'll leave that uh, leave that area behind us. No, say no boss uh, in, in in that area. So yay for that. Um, although, frankly, I would have almost taken a boss over that dreadful last save that you have to pull off. Oy. Anyway, yeah, I'll leave it there and we'll pick up next time with the third stage. Hope to see you for that, but until then, cheerio.